Hey everyone, we're here with gardening expert Nikki Shabor. And Nikki, what have you got me holding here? <laughs> I thought you were holding Fuzzy Wuzzy Lamb's Ear. Ooh. Isn't that a great name? Give it, give it a little rub, these leaves. They are so soft. Isn't that I wish awesome? you could feel like this. It actually, it does feel like a lamb's ear or even like a rabbit's it ear. It does. It's, it's so amazing. I want to wrap question. myself in this thing. <laughs> Make a great blanket if you could sew. Yeah. Well, the question is why am I making you hold this? Because we're talking about plants that deer find unpalatable. They're probably not going to eat them. I say probably because I don't know of any truly deer-proof plants, okay. but there's a lot they tend not to eat. Is it the texture? It that, is the texture, okay. yeah. Okay, so the texture puts them off? Fuzzy leaves often, yeah, they just don't like the, the, the taste of it in their mouth. I mean, I haven't asked a deer, yeah. but they tend not to eat them, and I believe it's because of the texture. And there's lots of plants that have grayish, soft-type leaves, so you can, you can try those in your garden as well. But and I also has... brought some other ones. Okay. Yeah, some herbs. Certain things like, you recognize this guy? Oh, it's lavender. It is lavender. And take a smell. Oh, it smells so good. All right, and because it smells so good, the deer don't like it. There's a lot of oils in these leaves, and the deer don't want to take a, a strong flavor like that in their mouth, so they tend not to eat that. And the same thing goes for basil. It also has a lot of essential oils in the leaves, and the deer just don't find that palatable. So planting basil and things like this, they're not going to come and munch on them like they would in other types of planters or in your garden. Perfect. So you're okay with, is that the only vegetable? Because people have vegetable gardens, so is that mostly, do they repel? Or you know, not repel, but deer don't, don't like vegetables? repel, I would love to say repel. <laughs> yeah. You know, there's a lot of vegetables deer love, okay. but there are a few they tend not to eat in my garden. For example, the garlic. Now, I did okay. call it deer proof earlier this year, and I was proven wrong a day later when they munched on my garlic because they were so hungry. <laughs> but it tends to be relatively deer free. Okay. Relatively. And same with the chives in my garden. Uh, there's lots of chives, and I eat them all the time, but the deer tend not to like them. They have a very strong onion flavor, so unpalatable to deer. But there's more ornamental plants you can grow as well. Okay, give this guy a feel. This is an ornamental grass, a maiden grass, and oh, I love nice. it. I have about 20 all throughout my property. It's a little prickly. If you it? run your yeah. hand down the leaves, it's a little prickly, and that's why the deer don't like it. It's got kind of a sharp sharpness, so if they bite it, it maybe, I don't know if it'll cut their mouth, but it's not a very nice taste. So they're kind of repelled by both texture and some scents, is yes, what you're saying? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, and even some other type of ornamental plants still be, uh, they don't tend to like those so much. Russian sage, and give this guy here behind you. This is Russian, Russian sage. It's a great ornamental, blooms for a long time, the bugs love it, the good bugs, I should say. It smells great, too. It's got a very strong fragrance, and the deer don't like it. All right. Well, that gives you, there's probably more, but that gives you a few. There's so many, yeah, absolutely. Well, brilliant information, as Thank usual. You. Thank you. <laughs> if you have any questions or comments for Nikki, please write to us. And as usual, you can follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Instagram. EasyTVOnline.com.